with CC Goldwater. CC just had the unique honor of introducing and, and giving the tally, of introducing the state of Arizona and then giving the tally for the nomination for president. But CC, it's your pedigree which makes it so unusual here in this hall. CC is the granddaughter of Barry Goldwater, former senator, former candidate for the presidency of the Republican Party. Wow. <laughs> I know, pretty kooky, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Tell me what your grandfather would have thought to have his daughter at the Democratic Convention. You know, I don't know, but um, based on what the Republican Party is doing now, I, I can only think that he'd just be, go girl. Really? Yeah, yeah. I mean, just so, it's just so different than what it was. You know, your, fa your grandfather's conservatism was a different breed of conservatism, but what would have made it different? We always think, oh, Gerald Ford wouldn't have been a Republican today. Barry Goldwater, maybe he wouldn't have been a Republican today. What about Barry Goldwater is not a Republican today? Well, his libertarian views, his, his um, thoughts on women's choice, um, civil liberties, freedoms, um, things that are just really proprietary to somebody that might not be a typical Republican of these days. I mean, the Republicans are just, just, they're just, they're different. They're whack now. You know, and when the hall hears that the Republicans are whack, when this hall that's still tallying right now, you're lucky you're from Arizona, you could have been from Tennessee still waiting for your, <laughs> for your state to be, yeah, uh, to be tallying. Uh, when this hall heard that, uh, what message did you want to send by saying, hey, look, Barry Goldwater's granddaughter's in the room? I just, I, I was hoping that the, the fact that my grandfather was so good at going, going across the aisle, you know, he was a Republican statesman, but he went across the aisle and negotiated with Democrats and got things done. And it was really all about that. I think that hopefully people will see that those kind of minds, those, those really, really wonderful leaders are, are people to remember. And hopefully that we can take a page from their book and apply it to the future, hoping okay. so. Very quickly, Cece, before we finish up, uh, what do the rest of the Goldwaters think of Cece being at the Democratic Convention? Oh God, I have no, I, I have no clue, and um, I'm sure I'll get it when I get back. But I know that I've got a handful of them that are so excited, and um, that's all I can say. I just, I'm excited. Cece yeah. Goldwater, thank thanks you. Very much. Thank you.